Hi, so here we have a solution to a problem which was sent by Chayan from Bangladesh and this is a problem in which we have to utilize the concepts of speed and distance. So here is the problem statement which says two boats are at the opposite shore of a river starts moving towards each other. When they pass each other they are 750 yards from one shoreline. So suppose we have boat A over here and we have boat B over here. Both of them starts moving towards each other and let's assume that the speed of A is more than the speed of B. It won't affect the generality of this question. So they will meet close to B because B is lower than A. And they meet here and the distance from this point to this shore is 750 yards and they each continue to the opposite shore immediately turn around and back so this is the second drawing where they first they met here and the a continues in this direction and b continues in this direction so a reaches the shore and then immediately turns around and starts moving in this direction right and b which started from this side of the river first met A over here and then it continues its journey and reaches over here and then again immediately turns around and starts moving in this direction and both of them meet over here for the second time and this time they are meeting 250 yards from the other shoreline. So this time the distance from here till here is 250 yards. Each boat maintains a constant speed throughout how wide is the river. So I have assumed that the width of the river is x and here they are meeting for the first time. So when they meet here the time used by both a and b is same and the time utilized by a will be the distance traveled by a divided by the speed of a. So the speed of a I have assumed as a and speed of b I have assumed as b. So time taken by a will be total width of the river minus 750 divided by the speed of a and this time will also be equal to the distance traveled by b which is 750 yards over here divided by the speed of b which is b. So x minus 750 divided by a will be equal to 750 divided by b. So this is my first equation and at the time of second meeting the distance covered by a is actually the complete width of the river plus this much distance and this much distance is x minus 250 because they are meeting 250 yards away from this shore. So the total time taken by a will be the distance traveled by a which is x plus this much. This much is x minus 250. So x plus x minus 250 divided by a and the time taken by b will be the distance traveled by b divided by the speed of b and the distance traveled by b is shown in the green line. So this is total x yards plus 250 yards and divided by the speed of b which is b and now if I divide equation 1 by equation 2 I'll get x minus 750 divided by this is 2x minus 250 this will be equal to 750 divided by x plus 250 right and now I will cross multiply so here I'll multiply x minus 750 with x plus 250 so it will be x square minus 500x minus 750 multiplied by 250 and this will be equal to 750 multiplied by 2x will be equal to 1500x minus 750 multiplied by 250. So this minus 750 multiplied by 250 will cancel this minus 750 multiplied by 250 and from these two terms I can take x common and inside the bracket I'll have x minus 500 and this will be equal to 1500 times x. So this x will cancel this x and from here I'll get x equal to 1500 and this minus 500 will go here and will become plus 500. So the value of x which is actually the width of the river is equal to 2000 yards. So thank you Chen for sending this problem and if you have any problem you can also send your problem. I'll try and solve it and if it is worth making a video I'll make a video on that problem. So keep watching MathSmart, subscribe to it and bye bye till then.